Welcome everyone to a brand new Warzone awesome video with Hatchet Skate, and as you can see today, I am not buying a BF109 or a Focal or uh, a uh, <clears throat> ME410. I am indeed flying the P47 Thunderbolt uh, German style. I know you'll be thinking, oh, that is an American plane, why have you even blessed your eyes on it? Uh, it's because I, well, I had two uh, options. I could have either tried to get the Tempest Mark V in the, the German Tempest Mark V uh, premium in uh, the thing, uh, the battle trophy, but uh, you know how unlucky, uh, unlikely that is to happen. Or I could just get this, which is uh, still a premium plane, you can still get a uh, sort of reward. And uh, yes, so I decided to get this because it's, it's less risk. As in, I would at least get something, and it's a hundred percent of me getting something, or a smaller percent of me getting something better. So I just went for this, and I uh, actually quite like it. It has a four twelve point. Uh, is it? Well, it has four fifty cal machine guns, which, uh, eight fifty cal machine guns, which is uh, okay. I know what you're thinking again. Fifty cal machine guns are bad, etc. But uh, actually, they are quite good. I think that's because it's uh, like a the Gaijin had put some uh, uh, overpoweredness into this, so it's more powerful the can uh, the machine guns because yes, they are pretty dangerous. I've killed lots of planes with this, uh, but yes. So we're now in the map Spain against Russians. With this plane, I know it's not very maneuverable, and so either I play really bad and die immediately, or I actually get lots of kills. I'm just looking. I think we've been up to it because that is a high to then yes 4.7 I think it's, it is 4.7 yes 4.7 this is a battle rating 3.7 so why sometimes you have the early spitfires and stuff like that and the noobs and that makes it easy killing for me but oh oh we got one here all right so, or oh, sometimes I see the football 95U2 with its uh, six cannons, and I uh, it's slightly underwhelming this plane compared to that, but that is okay, there's no problem with that. We have uh, now an approaching Peshka 8, which is, I think that's actually a dive bomber. Actually, I don't know. The Russians did have a dive bomber. Of course, it wasn't as good as the Junkers, but uh, yeah. So we start to fire. As you can see, I'm not used to getting the lead correctly with this plane. Because I haven't played with it. Uh, well, I haven't played with 50 cal guns. Uh, I've played with. Oh. We're in update 1.53, so if you uh, do tight uh, turns, then you lose control. Uh, yeah. But luckily, I. Oh, 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 that's not correct. That's not where I want to be. Right. Um, but yes, uh, it is extremely annoying. There is no way. To say how annoying it is, but it's realistic and well, well done, guiding for putting that in. Because as you know, the G force makes gravity stronger, and uh, yeah, let's just kill this annoying plane. Critical hit. I know I'm nitpicking it, but when you play with uh, liberated people, then they seem to forget the uh, common etiquette of uh, playing in realistic battles, that which is. Uh, do not kill steel. Do not. In the last game, I uh, had the beaten his on fire. And thankfully, I got the kill, but you could see someone or two people trying to put holes in it. It's like, die, won't you die? Because obviously, it's, uh, it's an easier target. And one is the beaten his fire, which I know has, is pretty powerful. Especially the Russian beaten his fire, which I think. But uh, then there's also the. It was on fire. And uh, it was dangerous. But that B25 took out my engine, so I died. Jeez, it's, it's the last battle I played, so. Oh, wait, it, was, it wasn't fresh B25. My bad. But as you can see, number one, I get a free repair for a limited amount of time, but I get a lot of uh, your search points. Okay, this one I didn't get. But, uh, not, not, but I get all sorts of money. So, for instance, this one. I uh, I don't think I I may have, might have destroyed. Actually, I didn't, don't think I did destroy any planes, and I got to look how much money. Not even money, just research points. I mean, I already have lots of money 
enough money to uh, buy the beef on 94, which I'm researching. Uh, yes. Now we need to. There is another Peshka over there ish. It's it's attack is over here. I, I need to I need to tell my teammates. Um, in case you haven't uh, played the new 1.5.3 yet, which is a new update for Wolfgang, there are some really horrible uh, voices. It's like, yes, I shall. I'm going to show you. So, just put this down, this down, this down. Right. This down. Affirmative! Can you hear that? Because it's horrible. Waiting for landing. Whoops. Thank you. It sounds horrible. Put that down. Da, 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 da. Bam. 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 But yes. You can barely hear it now because I turned down the volume. But uh, also been talking. I don't know what has happened to our bomber. Well, I say I have a bomber. It's the enemy bomber. But this plane. I would have said it's suited for attacking bombers because it has a heavy machine gun fire. It's also great for attacking fighter planes because it's got a heavy, a nice large rate of fire. Yeah, I don't see a bomber. Sad. It's got a quick rate of fire, which means it's easy. It's good for attacking nimble planes and also it's pretty fast. Um, I was one playing with this before. Planes with ah, oh, there, there we are. There we are. Okay, we see him. Yes, yes, we see one, a Peshka, again, the one that we are destroyed, uh, peppered with holes. They have destroyed a, uh, observation craft, I suppose, yes, they have. And as you can see, this Peshka is causing a lot of nuisance, ba 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 Like I said, I, I don't need to delete this. I, I don't, I don't know, delete at all for this. Oh, whoops, right. So that's the thing, instead of... Usually we just ignore the Overlord's energy, but uh, yeah, you shouldn't ignore it. It's a bad idea. Now, as you can see, it's on fire, but there isn't an enemy. Uh, there isn't a friendly plane near us, so that's AA. Uh, I don't want AA to get. Uh, there we are. But that's what. Well, that's what I mean by overpowered uh, weapon, because that is a. Well, actually, I don't think it's a heavy bomb, but it is. It's oh, we have a friend. Ouch. Oh, yay! My friend saved me. See, that is the merits of playing a team. Yes. Although the German teams are, um, do uh, play as a team instead of individually, which is actually um, amazing. It is honestly a, whoops, a uh, large advantage. As you can see, my teammates rushed to aid me, and uh, we have one here. And now I'm not going to go for the. Uh, uh, AI because uh, we actually have a proper pain to kill. It is a Yak 9, a Yak 9, yes, I thought that effort would be a little bit. Right. Let me just. Uh, actually, this plane is okay at doing head on, it's not amazing. And as you can see, this this guy has surrendered his uh, uh, higher. Uh, what's it called? High altitude to engage me, which is nice of him, but I'm afraid I cannot. Uh, I cannot uh, help him out with this, okay, I'm just going to call for cover. I think we have another thing behind. Uh, uh, okay, right. I do need cover though, as you can see, I am actually being shot at. Uh, but luckily, someone has said yes. Okay, we got a hit, we got a hit, and an enemy gets which is exactly what I wanted, because he was, uh, well, either he had problems killing him and I would have helped, or... Well, he had it fine, I would have got a, a, got a kill assist and he got the kill, which, oh, there's no problem. Okay, this is exactly what you do not do when you attack uh, me. That's a critical um, leave here. That's the problem, the etiquette of uh, realistic battles. Of course, in our case, getting a kill is much easier, but uh, the realistic battles, um, it isn't. You know, I'm not going to engage him because he is burning. So, uh, you know, fuel tank, that is, that is a critical one. Goodbye. Oh, no. Nope, he's still alive. As in, he's out of fire. As in, the fire has burnt out. Look at my bird. Okay, there we are instead. 
there wasn't really any way he could have uh, uh, covered that because, well, he didn't have any fuel, which is, uh, well, in order to have a thing, you really, uh, like, you really should have fuel. I just knocked to my thing thingy. But yes, you should really have fuel. Um, just in case you were uh, wondering how to build a plane, then fuel is good. Of course, it's not essential. Yeah, fuel is essential. Ha, you must be laughing. Uh, but yeah. But what I'm going to do now is I'm going to camp over the runway. Because uh, this plane automatically had 30 minutes of fuel. Uh, which is great. I didn't do it there. Uh, so, yes. Camp over the runway. I have lots of fuel. 20 minutes worth of fuel. Oh, our base has been destroyed. Thank you, sir. That gives us a very good indication of where he is. Now I'm rushing. Okay, that's our SP the SP2M. So now I'm rushing towards that area because, um, yes, we have an enemy bomber. Which is okay, we. Oh. Oh look at that! Luckily, the one, the first video I recorded with this plane is uh, a game where I actually do well, which is great. Oh wait, is it? Of course, yeah. Other things that I've included in the update 1.53 is uh, new British tanks. Yay! Clap, clap. Uh, they're all premium, and you need to buy them with real money. And it's not like this. You know, it's just a little bit of money. It's Real dosh, like step it down on the table, it's actually expensive. But hopefully, I'll make a video where I test them out and destroy it since I can't buy them. But yes, as you can see, I am rushing towards uh, the our bases, well, what's left of our base, because there is a bomber here somewhere. We have the three people uh, left in there, too. And I can't read Russian, because if I could read Russian, then I would know. Alright, scanning. It's unlikely they'll be up there because they're easy to spot. That's, that's the thing with mummers. Um, they're likely to be low down, which I know makes them easier to kill, but it also makes them harder to spot, and especially with mummers like the Wellington, which has, well, I won't say virtually defense because it does have, it doesn't have any. Okay, right. There's one. There's a yak, uh, and we have. Uh, Two people, as you can see. Right, wait, got overload. Because there is, there is. Okay, this is the person that uh, dropped a bomb on our base. So there, there is a uh, bomb somewhere. Unfortunately, this won't tell us where our allies are. Where are... Okay, there must be a... Again, in the update, something where you cannot see uh, where your teammates are in the map or when you further away and the line doesn't work, etc, etc, which is annoying. Uh, but, yeah. We have had um, X, uh, X28. Right, over here, somewhere. So we climb up. This plane is half decent at climbing. I know I've read that it's horrible at climbing and you decide to climb, which is actually, which doesn't mean it is really bad at climbing. At climbing, climbing. But uh, my uh, thoughts with it about it is, um, it is a lowish tier. It's like 3.7, okay, that's, that's some good things at 3.7, including this one, but, uh, it's not bad. Yeah, it must be annoying, but that means he is, uh, he is, uh, yes, with the airfield, possibly, but yes, now we just waste our time. Okay, thanks, I was correct. Um, but what we do have is uh, three planes in that side, including one bomber, or at least uh, some a plane with bombs, which of course could be the new Yak 9 B, is it? They have a new Yak 9, the Russians, with bombs. And uh, we have one, two, 
pick up three, four, five, six, seven. Seven was three, and we have the. Uh, we have me. Yes, hello, hello. Three kills and one assist, which is actually great. Of course, we do not. Uh, the blind hunt is now useless. Which is something, which is something I think they added in the new update. There's also bad stuff they added in the new update, but um, make it more realistic. Okay, we have a uh, fights going on here somewhere over the airfield. Somewhere, <laughs> okay, right. So at the moment, I am uh, climbing. I'm climbing a bit more. They are. I think they're trying to pull this out. out the, the enemy team. Which are they going to win? I don't know whether we can get to ground forces victory with the AI just ground forces. Although I mean, we do have a few amount of planes. And I am back, and we have now one player left. Holodov, Holodov, Holodov. Enemy location. Enemy location. Grits and clap. Actually, grits is a fire. Fire can come out of the So, yes. Uh, currently, we uh, do not know where the enemy is. Which is, uh, that's a bit annoying, I have to say, but um, again, real life, real life, uh, we don't know where the enemy is. Of course, my people now are Russian, and I only have two left. Because of that annoying, stupid Russian AI, AA. I get, I, I, I can't, I don't know what it means. Grid. Right, because I, I honestly, E A twenty five. Luckily, um, I think that's yes, Google Translate. But uh, uh, yes, I don't, I don't know. But luckily, I am actually climbing. To, I am actually a really high uh, altitude. Actually, this is actually really high. Um, unlikely that enemy plane will be this high. But uh, yeah, over the airfield. Which is the uh, which is the correct location to be because there's how many things have they killed one two and we only have two players left so basically the base AA is overpowered. That's what you have learnt this lesson uh, this video this lesson this bit. I try to oh yay I can activate an altar yay 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 yay. yay. I only did that because uh, I am special. Um, over the airfield, this guy here is going to exactly lower altitude than me, which is great because this plane is not really known for being a high altitude fighter. But uh, as you can see, I'm actually at a high altitude, 7,000 meters, which is in the stratosphere, so I am hiding in the stratosphere. So, uh, yeah. Said it was somewhere over the airfield. I think I'm too high for the base AA to kill me. So this is like me a stealth mission. Dun, 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 dun. Also, something amazing about this is that even though it's a German plane, I can actually read English. Flap warning: Do not lower flaps above 195 miles per hour. And uh, so I can actually lower my flaps now. I'm going to dive down because there is. Slow down. Okay. Um. Which pin did he have? We have one IG to turn with the yak. Uh, let's. We don't have any location. Uh, here he is running. Uh, which is annoying. I now just lost uh, 2000 altitude. Okay, he's a Commodore. This is what I do when I'm bored. I just look at what I, like other people have, and then they'll be disappointed at me because, yeah. 
Damn it, damn it, damn it. So we cannot know where the enemy is. Which is annoying. Stop running. It's like the worst thing ever. Ah, no, we've got him, we've got him, we've got him. Uh, right. As you can see, we do uh, have the last enemy, who is the person that's cap. Oh my god, did, did he just. Did he just. He did not. Oh my, this is ridiculous, ridiculous. And I'm going too fast, I'm going too fast. Please, 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 no, please, no. Okay, right. Well, basically, I, I do want to. Uh, I do want to go at a really high speed to him. Don't lose control. Right. As you can see, our year two is uh, happily standing over here. He's on fire. So, uh, let's just uh, add uh, more stuff to him. And. Aircraft destroyed. Here we are, everyone. We have won this match. Yes, no, uh, this. Please, no, please, 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 okay, right. So, oh, and I've got the objective, so, yes, uh, what is my uh, opinion on people at 7? It's, it's, great, it's great, uh, great thing. It's honestly amazing. And, oh, oh, <laughs> I got the beef. Oh, no, oh, that is amazing. I, I am honestly so happy. I am honestly so happy. BF on a 9k4, amazing. Phew. Uh, uh, I don't know. I don't know. Just, 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 just take, take my pain. Take my pain. Thank you for watching, everyone. That was great. It's amazing. Thank you.